Welcome to PreciousMetalConverter.com. Learn how to value your precious metals. Today on this video, we're going to be explaining how to value uh, your items, uh, gold and silver, using 100% of the value. It's important to remember that when selling your items, the dealers you're going to be selling them to do not receive 100% of the value of your items. For gold, they'll receive anywhere from 90 to 95%. And for silver, it's anywhere from 80 to 85 percent um, when they uh, go to you know sell to the refineries. And it's also important to remember that there are different holding periods depending on the state and municipal laws. Having said that, let's get started. When valuing your gold or silver. There's three main inputs that you're going to be using. The first would be the purity of that item. The second is the weight of that item. And the third will be the price of gold or silver on the day that you're going to be doing your calculations. So let's check out the first input, the purity. Now when looking at gold, you're gonna be dealing with uh, carats. 10, 14, 18, 24. These uh, give you a, a breakdown of the percent of gold in your item, okay? If your item's marked 10 carats, it's 41.7% gold. All the way down to 24%, you can see is pure gold. So when looking at your items, Look to see if you see any marks, 10, 14, 18, okay? Silver, that's basically measured in two um, purities, one being uh, coins or bullion, which are pure 99.99, and sterling, which is 92.5%. Um, you might see items that are marked 800, which are 80% silver, uh, but for the most part, you're going to be dealing with pure silver or sterling. And here at the bottom, we have uh, wikipedia.org. We'll give the breakdowns for uh, carrots and also for uh, purities in uh, silver. The second input will be weight. Precious metals are weighed in troy ounces. Okay, they're different from uh, regular ounces. Troy ounces are broken down into either 20 penny weights or 31.1 grams, depending on what type of uh, calculation you want to be using. Uh, you know, if you want to use penny weights or grams. If you're going to use uh, uh, penny weights, there's one penny weight is equal to 1.555 grams, and one gram is equal to 0.643 penny weights. And you can uh, fool around with those conversions um, you know, on our site or check out metricconversions.org um, to do uh, some more conversions. So that's your second input. And the third input is going to be the price. A lot of gold dealers who use Kitco gives you live prices in gold and silver. You can also check out uh, CNBC uh, or Bloomberg. Okay, let's get uh, started here with calculating the price of gold in penny weights and grams. Okay, we know that uh, today's uh, gold price we're going to be using is eighteen hundred and thirty dollars. There's twenty penny weights in every troy ounce. Okay, so it's simple uh, division there, and we come up with uh, $91.50 per penny weight uh, when gold is trading at $1,830 an ounce, uh, troy ounce. And for grams, it's $1,830 divided by 31.1. Okay, that equals $58.84 per gram. And this calculation, again, is for pure gold or 24 carat. Now using this as a basis, 
let's uh, do some calculation for uh, you know 14 carat. We know again we're using the same 1830 dollars. It's uh when you break that down, it's 91 dollars and 50 cents per penny weight, or 58 dollars and 84 cents a gram. Okay, so let's just take that pure uh, penny weight price and uh, times that by uh, 0.585 for 14 karat gold. We know 14 karat gold is 58.5% uh, gold. So we come up with uh, $53.52 per penny weight when measuring, uh, you know, for uh, 14 karat gold when gold is trading at $1,830. For grams, I want to take $58.84, again, times 0.585 for the priority of 14 carat, and that comes out to be $34.42 per gram. Let's say we have an item that's about 15 penny weights today, and uh, at today's price of $1,830, okay, we know uh, each penny weight is $53.52. So 15 times uh, 53.52 is approximately $802.75. Now 15 penny weights is approximately 23.32 grams. Okay, we're gonna times that by the per gram price of 14 today, which is $34.42. And again, you get approximately $800 and two dollars and seventy five cents. And just mention here, obviously, if you're dealing with eighteen carat, you'd be it'd be point seven five. And check out our website, you know, you'll you'll be able to figure out the uh, other conversions. Calculating purity of silver in penny weights and grams. Let's use the silver price of $41.50. We know there's 20 penny weights in every troy ounce. So $41.50 divided by 20 is $2.07 per penny weight. And for grams, we're gonna divide by 31 dollars and 30, 31, excuse me, 31.1 grams, not dollars, and that equals $1.33 uh, per gram. Again, this calculation is for pure silver. All right, let's do some other calculations for uh, silver here. We're going to use the same numbers as the previous page. And we know sterling is 92.5% uh, uh, silver. So we take the full value of silver, which is uh, $2.07 per uh, penny weight, and times that by 0.925, and we come out with $1.91 per penny weight. Um, so for every penny weight of sterling silver you have, when silver is trading at $41.50, the approximate value is $1.91. And grams, it's $1.33 for the uh, you know 100% pure silver times again 0.925 and you come out with a dollar 23 per gram now we're going to do 15 penny weights times 1.91 dollars and you come up with $28.60 now if you remember from the 50 uh, example before the 15 penny weights of gold it was approximately Eight hundred and two dollars and seventy-five cents. So there's a big difference um, between uh, the value of your gold items and your silver items. And here at the bottom, you see twenty-three point three two grams. This is uh, times a dollar twenty-three for the gram price of sterling today. And again, it's approximately twenty-eight dollars and sixty cents. Now check this out at preciousmetalconverter.com for more educational videos on how to uh, value uh, your items and uh, to find out exactly what you have.
Thanks for visiting us. Ciao.